Hi, Aries. This is Kathy. Welcome to my channel, Kathy Mamelin, Psychic Medium. Welcome to a timeless love reading for my Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and any cross watcher. So grateful that you're here. Let's see what loving messages that Spirit has for you today. Spirit, please share with me. I am listening for you now. I have adventures, having a new experience, and making new friends. So are we ready for a new adventure? I love that. It's almost a feeling of um, a surprise, um, a new adventure, a new journey, you know, any of those things. So what is happening? Is this something new that's come into your life? Let's say I have harmony being in tune with each other. Maybe we're just starting to feel like this is starting to work or this is going to work. I have a divine match. Oh, I love that. Look for feathers. Following your destiny and a love that's meant to be a soulmate or a twin flame energy. That this is a divine match. That is beautiful. That's what we're all looking for. We, we want that feeling of, I just know you're supposed to be in my life. And I know that you were sent to me. I have control, taking responsibilities for both actions and emotions. You are always in charge, okay? You're always in charge of who you invite into your energy or who you don't. As much as you want the divine um, match, you, want, you don't want somebody to come into your energy who's going to take over your life that's filled with, you know, crazy and drama. So I like this kind of new adventure, this surprise journey or whatever spirit's trying to share with me, Aries. Let's see what the cards are saying. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome to anybody that's new. I'm so grateful that you're here. Hit that like and subscribe button. Comment below. Spirit, share with me this adventure. I love adventure. I have a ten of swords. So after an ending, I have a magician. I have a nine of pentacles, seven of swords. And I have a three of pentacles. So it is coming into me as an ending after lies, unfortunately, whether it was somebody cheated on you or made promises and didn't keep the promises. So, but for every ending, there's a new beginning. So let the adventure begin. You know, <laughs> maybe it's like goodbye, good riddance. And the person that's coming into your energy has a little bit more of a sense of stability. They also have a lot more to offer is how it just came into me that you're going to look up to this person, admire this person in some way. They may have some talent, some skills, something about them that you admire. I have a higher fan. You could be more connected spiritually to this person. You just could have, um, have the same belief systems, morals, values. Uh, this person says, I would never be the one that cheated on you. I'm not a cheater. Uh, you know, so it, it's just a different person. I have a six of pentacles. This is going to be a more giving connection, a little bit more uh, or very much more balanced and equal. So it's just a whole different person. Put it that way. I have a knight of swords. Let's get this thing going. And I have an emperor. This person's very self-secure. I do feel the sense of security and I do feel the sense of this person has a lot to offer. Bottom of the deck is a queen of cups. So that is coming into me as this person is fulfilling some emotional, um, you know, area of your life that you haven't felt before, Spirit just said, or a sense of emotional security. So it could be, I trust this person. It could be as simple as that that somebody's finally come into your life that you truly trust with your heart and your soul, that this person's intentions are not to hurt you. And that's not everybody. That's not everybody who comes into our, into our life. So I feel like you're going to feel different when you're with this person for those reasons. I have making, this is coming into me as like making the magic happen. A <laughs> little bit of our, our hands working together. Um, we can make it happen. We can make anything happen. We can build the life that we want. We can achieve the goals we want. We can start a business. We can move. We can have a family. You know, it's like if our both hands working together, we can do this. Um, I have anxiety. 
Now that is the feeling of I'm so used to having somebody that stresses me out. For those of you have, who have been in relationships where the person is very controlling or narcissistic or they have they don't have their act together and they create all this chaos around them because they just, you know, they don't can't keep a job, they can't pay their bills. So there's always like these putting out fire energies. Um, their anxiety becomes your anxiety because we pick up on everybody else's emotions. So if you don't want that in your life, you stay away from that. If the person that you meet has all kinds of problems and they're always like in, in a mess and in trouble some way, you can't fix them. They've got to fix those things themselves. So you don't need that anxiety in your life is how I feel. You need trust. So they're taking something, they're, they're showing you, I guess I want to say it this way, that somebody who wants to do it with you, like we can work together to make it, make anything happen. Trust me. And this is going away. This anxiety that you felt in the past or how somebody always made you feel like you're, you know, walking on eggshells or you were just waiting for something to happen. So like, what's the next thing that's going to happen in this connection? I feel like spirit's taken that all away from you. Did I just say spirit? How beautiful. <laughs> um, so I feel like spirit's taken that all away from you. It was like a sense of just trust us. Like we know what you need right now. And we're going to bring that to you. Tell me more about this connection, this beautiful adventure that we're going to be on. A proposal. This person's going to lead to a future this is a future, somebody who wants a commitment, somebody who wants to, um, you know, just be in a relationship, in a long-term relationship. If that's what you both decide, that's what you both want. Beautiful. I have time to celebrate. There it is. We're going to celebrate champagne, a proposal, maybe an engagement party. I mean, that looks like a wedding to me. So maybe we really are going to be with this person. Oh, look at the sparks. Keep the sparks flying. Surprise each other with gestures of love. So lots of sparks are flying. I love that. So you can tell that there's, it's almost as if spirit removed somebody from your life that was causing tremendous anxiety and brought you, they're saying bottom of the deck, falling fast. Love happens quickly, but don't lose yourself. Um, I think spirit remove. it's almost like spirit removes something from your life that was causing you tremendous anxiety. The person who you were in a relationship with that maybe you had a hard time getting out of that relationship. Maybe it took a long time to be free of it for some reason, but it, it's almost a feeling of I'm free and then no sooner are you free that this beautiful, fast, romantic love comes in, okay? And you realize that there can be a whole new life ahead of you that's totally different. And you are surprised by this new journey, maybe because you're falling fast. Maybe you do see it as an adventure because everything about this person is so different. And so everything is new. So it can be very, very exciting. I can see where the sparks are flying. How beautiful. Let's see what else they have. An ace of pentacles. That's coming into me as I have something to offer. I have some security in my life. I do pay my bills. I do. Um, I don't have fires to put out. I don't have the anxiety that you had in the past. I'm more stable. Like you can see the stability in this new person. And I can see that you're very drawn to that. It doesn't mean you're drawn to their wealth. It means that you're drawn to their ability to create stability within their own life. And that's something that you value. That's something that is important to you because maybe those things are something that you're able to achieve on your own. Here's a star. I, I love this. Look at the sparks. Where's my, where's my falling fast? So I'm falling fast because this is what I hope for. Okay. This is what I dreamt of. It took you, I feel like it took you a long time to get away from the past whether it just took you a long time to get somebody out of your system 
or it physically took you some time to remove yourself from a situation, you know, be on your own, be free. Like this, there's a sense of freedom. Okay. It, that's when this freedom appears or when this freedom appeared in your life or came into your life, I feel like that's when this love arrives and it's just beautiful. So they want you to keep trusting yourself with that high priestess. And then this is a true love. This is a divine match. They had said a divine match. So here's your divine match. Here it is. It's like this is what you this is what you have been hoping for and this is what you've been wishing for. So I, I have no doubt in my mind that wherever you were or who went, wherever you had been, spirit picked you up and moved you and literally put you on a new path. They literally picked you up. So that's beautiful. Marry me, a commitment. They have something to offer. This person wants a lifetime with you. I can't picture my life without you. I always love that energy. My feelings are deeper than they seem. So I feel like this person is, how do you, you know, sometimes you, you look at somebody and you say, I love you, but you wish you could say something that had more, even a deeper meaning than I love you, <laughs> even though we know that like I love you is kind of like the most important thing. But how can I tell you how much I love you? I want, did I just say how much? Did I just say how much? I want to show you how much I value you. I love that. I love that. Spirit, thank you. And you are my light in the dark. How beautiful. And late at night, sometimes I can't sleep just thinking about you. You're on my mind all the time. And I belong to you only. So this is a divine match. This is a divine match. And that's what I want you to hold on to. They value you. They only want to be with you. And whatever happened in the past, whatever was removed from your life or you removed yourself from them, you're not there today. And whatever that, I, I'm using the word freedom because I feel like it really was, it really was setting yourself free. I, I, you know, maybe you felt like you were trapped in a relationship for a long time, but I really believe that that is, that was the, that was the beginning of you know, this incredible new journey for you to meet this divine match. So how gorgeous, how amazing. I want to thank Spirit for this reading today. If you're new to my channel, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you always for your kind words. I really appreciate it. If anybody would like to book a private reading with me, please check out my website at kathymamelinpsychicmedium.com.